Hello, it's me, your favorite president, Donald Trump. And it's time for the Trump movie minute. Did you see that new movie, Civil War? What a great picture. I didn't know they were making a picture about the next Trump administration, but they did a terrific job. The guy they got to play me isn't as handsome as your favorite president, but I liked him in that Parks and Rec show. What's his name? Nick Offerman? Great guy. He called me for tips when researching the role. The director I heard is an American. I'll have to check if he's here illegally, probably snuck through the border, but he'll be gone when I'm back in office. In the movie, I'm serving a third term because that's what America wants. You want me to get the job done just like FDR did. People start protesting, so I send out the National Guard to stop them because that's what you do with protesters. You shoot them. During my first term, my Secretary of Defense told me that you couldn't shoot them. Can you believe that? It's true. This was during the George Floyd protests. And I said, why don't we just shoot the bastards? And he said, he said, sir, you can't shoot them. It violates their constitutional rights. And I said, well, just shoot them in the legs. And he said, sir, that still violates their rights. That's why I fired him, because he wouldn't do what I asked him to. In my next term, I'll have people who will violate the Constitution when I demand it. But in the film, some states secede over my actions. One of them is California, and the other is Texas. Good riddance to California, but Texas. That's probably the only unrealistic part of the movie. There's also a bunch of fake news photographers trying to interview me, which never happens. Lots of great action in this film and suspense. I didn't make it to the end because I was watching it at my trial, and that's when they called us in to say the jury had made a decision. Let me know in the comments how I handled the fake news photographers. Leave a thumb and like and subscribe, and as always, elect your favorite felon so we can make America great again.